Hi guys, Tasha here. I'm back with another video. Before we get started, I want to say welcome to all those that have subscribed since the last video. Thank you so much. It is greatly appreciated. May God bless you all. And I want to say thank you to those that continue to watch and support this channel. May God bless you all as well. So today's video, I'm a little excited about because it is a curly unit. And I love all things curly. Um, you can't really go wrong with a curly unit. The only thing that might mess you up is if you get a color that doesn't suit you. But other than that, I don't think I've ever came across a curly unit that I didn't like. If I did, I can't remember. And I've worn many of them. Like at one point, that's all I wore was curly units. I was known for curly hair. And that's something because I haven't worn one in months. Like, I don't know what's going on. What happened with that? But um, I have one today. It is an outro unit. It is a part of their lace front uh, collection. And I have it in a style Luciana. And I have it in the color DR Ginger Brown. DR2 Ginger Brown. My safe color for outro. That's how she looks. Okay, that's the bag, all the specialty colors. And so um, with this stock card, I think that was the Wheeler wig I reviewed. It has this same stock card and I was wondering if it was new. I didn't know if it was new or not because I did a review on the Outtree Brandy wig, which came out maybe three or four years ago, two, three years ago. And so I was saying, I didn't know if that, the Wheeler was new or old because it had the same stock card. But what I've learned is that Outtree brought this line out again. Um, and I learned that because of the colors, the ginger, ginger brown, Cajun spice, all that. These are all new colors. I mean, not new, new, but maybe almost two years old. So they brought it out. They brought the uh, line back out. And they really, this is the wig, cute curls, and this ginger brown, I'm not mad at, it's not, I learned, you know, with the, across the different lines, they're not going to be the same, definitely not Julianne ginger brown, it's not the Mindy, that dark uh, ginger brown, this is almost like a 350 color, and you see we got the uh, number two all throughout which I think it's pretty. We got the little humpy hump action going on at the top. And I see that she's wearing it as a middle part. And I don't too much care for a uh, middle part um, wig. So I'm gonna see what I can do with it. So the inside construction, oh, the lace. We got baby hairs across the lace. Um, so the lace is pretty, uh, decent you can get away with whatever you choose to put in there but with this going on at the top you're not going to see the the lace like talking about it unless you put it on like that but the inside construction is typical two combs on the side one in the back adjustable straps so yeah we're gonna go cut the lace and come right back I forgot to mention. If anyone is wondering what is on my head, this is Altree's Daily Wig Delania. And the video to this wig is right under this one. Um, it might look a little different now than it did then. Because, um, like, especially this side, it was flat. I just took my wide tooth comb and parted the hair and teased it down, teased it out, teased it down to give it some fullness. I like it much better now. Yeah, so if you're interested in this one, I'll leave the link in the description box below, or you can just go to the video underneath this one. Now I'm going to cut that lease. Hi guys, I'm back with the union on. See, I can go out just like this. No fluffing, no tuffing, or anything like that. It is really cute, and I didn't think that I was gonna like it in a um, center part. But I do. It's really cute. I took the liberty of um doing my edges because you all know the baby hair does not work for me. 
and I did spread some of my even in it, but like I said, with this kind of part, that doesn't really matter. It is uh, semi-behave friendly. Like it's not sitting, it should really probably be sitting a little more to the front than what it is right now. A lot of my edges are, a lot of my edges are exposed and I really don't like that, having to manipulate them every day. But to wear this one, I probably will have to. So yeah, this is the unit on again. I'm manipulating nothing done to it. It is, it's not yaggy. So it is like a light silky, like one below, uh, one before yaggy texture hair. And I'm really, really liking it. I'm liking the color, everything about it is cute, fresh out the paint. So we wanna do something to it. So let me give a spin around before we fluff and tuck. That's the back. And the other side. Okay, let's get the fluffing. Even though it's much, and I like, like, I don't wanna say it's super big, but like big curly hair and like, the way it was a second ago it was just fine for me so we don't have to do much uh and i'm really i can't believe i'm liking it as a center part i'm really liking that i mean that's the way it's meant to be worn but i, I guess because it's framed it's uh layered Maybe if it was all one length, it wouldn't have had looked as cute as it does. Yeah, the teaser technique to fluff out your units, especially curly ones. But I do do it on, uh, see, I do do it on the straight units that need to be fluffed out now. Like the one I just, well, that wasn't too straight. But um, this is so pretty. I really, really, this is the wig that's being worn to work Monday. If we go going to work Monday, because um, I'm in New Orleans and we have a little system, hurricane, that may be coming here. If not directly here, then uh, somewhere in Louisiana and we still gonna get um, some effects from it. So definitely gonna be praying about that. This is super cute. I, okay, I mean, not much needs to be done. See, this is why I love curly units. Put on and go. bottom almost never gets right. You feel? There we go. That side is okay. So, I will actually wear this in a meal, you guys. I am so shocked. I will wear this just like this. Okay, so see how this side needs a little more and I'm not combing through the curls I'm just scraping the roots down you know you always one side always gotta one side always gotta ache bad <laughs> even with our real hair our natural hair it always one side always, I don't know. I, I know what we need. One side always don't want to give you any egg right. So this is like, I'm really, really, really liking it. And I would have to buy the pin. And I thought I was going to, you know, have to put the humpy hump down. Nah, mm -mm. I need some humpy hump action. But um, I'm definitely going to buy the pin now or 
I'm gonna use these, utilize these cones on the side for right now so it can stay still. But I will definitely, when I wear it, I'm gonna uh, use my, what it is, wig grip or some bobby pins to hold it in place, but the wig grip is easier. So you see, yeah, it's, I'm gonna say it's not behave friendly because even with the cones, like, okay, that's not too much of my edges. Just, I probably just put too much out right here. I gotta bring it back some. Okay. So this is really, really pretty. Um, Y'all might not see me for a month because I could wear a curly unit for a whole month with no problem. I'm just playing. I'm not going to stay away that long. So I want to try it as a side part. Let's see. Let's see. Side part action. I'm a left part girl. So, of course, we're going to try the left first. But now, I'm for whatever side it looks the best on. So, it looks good as a side part as well. Yeah. We already got the hump giving us our little bang. You just have to tease this a little more down here. Give you... So yeah, it looks cute as a side part too. Let's try the right side. Okay, no, no right side. And see, that's what I was talking about. It being all worn, it's not layered. So it don't exactly look the best. Nope. Left side it is. Okay, left and middle part, but I'm definitely going to wear it as a middle part first. Okay, so that's it, you guys. Really cute unit. Oh, I paid, how much I paid for this? never fully prepared i'm so sorry you guys i bought it off of amazon let's see your orders okay okay come on the people are waiting t-mobile Pay a little too much money for this slow internet. Okay, hold on. Okay, she's. I paid thirty-two dollars, and on the Google search engine, she's twenty-seven thirty-two. 27 27 so right at 30 dollars and this this is not bad this is 30 dollars well spent so uh i guess their outtrace lace front is another one of their affordable they they becoming like walmart like a one-stop shop like you can get your high price 60 dollars all the way to 15 dollars like they don't want you to go anywhere and they have uh, a variety of wigs that I mean, I'm thinking everybody will love. And so, um, yeah, this is this is $30 well spent, well spent. But I ordered mine from Amazon, you guys, and I got it and I ordered it Saturday and it came Monday. So that was very, very fast shipping, one day shipping. So that's it for this video, you guys. I'm really, really loving this units um everyone be blessed stay blessed have a good weekend bye bye